Lou Brugman, who's in the courtroom, uh, reporting that uh, Donald Trump has not only been in the courtroom now for about 15 minutes before that federal magistrate, uh, surrounded by two attorneys, one on each side of the former president, but at the other table are two federal prosecutors, and standing behind them, uh, Pierre Thomas, is Jack Smith, the special counsel. I had reasons to suspect that he would be there. Um, this case is both personal and professional. Personal in the sense that the FBI agents and the prosecutors who worked on this case were under enormous pressure to do it by the book and to come back with facts that he could use in, in the case. So that's the personal part. Professional part is, uh, I think it's important to him to send the signal to the troops. I'm with you all the way in a case that we've never seen before. I mean, the thing that's striking, we, we keep coming back to it, Dave. Donald Trump is the most unique criminal defendant in the history of the country, period. You saw traffic blocked several lanes, so his motorcade. Most criminal defendants don't go to court with a motorcade. You know, all the system is designed to respect him, even as the case is trying to administer justice in a way that it would for anyone else. It's a fascinating thing we're watching unfold here. The special counsel knows that. Um, he, his being there is in part to send a signal to all those involved that we've taken this dramatic step, we're going to do it by the book, and my presence here is to indicate that I'm in full support because there are all kinds of issues about security for these people as well. They, they've been very direct with us in terms of not putting out the names of some of the investigators, not putting out the names of some of the team members. This is all as, as serious as it gets. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.